biggest dish in the streets. It's what everyone's talking about on Facebook. Twitters and Facebooks and all that stuff. It's time for Big Tigger's Trending Topics on V103. Oh. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, time for the trending topics being brought to you by Icebox Diamond Jewelry and Watches in Buckhead. For the best place to buy, sell, or trade high quality diamonds, jewelry, and watches, visit iceboxjewelry.com. All right, where to start? This is all about celebrity couples in some way, form, or fashion, or ex couples. The mother of Nas's 19 year old daughter, Miss Carmen, is demanding that the rapper pay more than $11,000 in back child support. Another day. Another child support claim. According to court documents obtained by TMZ, Carmen Bryant filled legal documents claiming the rapper is a, quote, repeat criminal non-supporter. She also accused him of not paying his daughter's medical bills or tuition. And if Nas doesn't pay up, Bryant is asking that he be cited for contempt. These daddies and these mamas with these babies and these payments, I just don't understand. Let's move on to somebody who may at some point be at the center of some baby uh, support payments. Robin Thicke got back to performing last night, wasting no time using the stage to beg for his uh, uh, estranged wife, Paula Patton's mercy. Let's listen to him open up to the crowd in Washington, D.C. For those of you who don't know, my wife and I got separated a few days ago. Yeah. I want everybody to hear know that I'm trying to get my girl back. a good woman, you know. Oh, he also told fans he'd written the song Lost Without You for Paula before going into the song. He might literally be lost without her because somebody, even though we're not able to confirm it was him, sent a floral assault, floral assault <laughs> to Paula Patton's Hollywood Hills home. She was inundated with gigantic expensive floral arrangements yesterday, hours before Robin got on stage and told the audience he's trying to get his girl back, all right? And last but not least, uh, we'll ask celebrity couple. Uh, Kim uh, Ye or Kanye and Kim Kardashian, you know, they're doing everything. Okay, I have a question, fellas. If somebody says, I want to hire your fiancé to be my guest of honor, to be my, basically, my arm candy... At a ball in Vienna. You gonna let it happen? Well, Kanye let his woman, Kim Kardashian, be on the arm of an 83 year old, excuse me, 81 year old Austrian businessman. I mean, she got paid a half a million dollars, but I'm saying, this principality is involved. This principality. My wife ain't supposed to be on nobody else's arm. <laughs> Unless it's in a movie or something like that. Maybe he was too focused on his Yeezus tour coming to the big screen. He unveiled the trailer to the upcoming film based on his most recent tour, set to the track Cold as Winter. The preview features footage from Kanye on stage as well as the elaborate stage set. Music video hype uh, Williams is directing the flick, which the website promises will appear in theaters. So far, no announced date. Uh, he wrapped up the second leg of the tour on Sunday and in May plans to hit Australia. You gonna pay your girl five hundred thousand dollars come to your show in Australia? <laughs> That's crazy. Who does that? Apparently they do. Thanks for listening to the trending topics, people. Um, if you miss any part of this particular conversation, head on over to v-103.com where you can not only listen to it in, in its entirety, you can see my my baby ain't going nowhere with nobody eighty one for a half a million dollars face. Okay, maybe we'll think about it. Big take with the three things you need to know up next right here on v one hundred three. 